missed you. Call me back. Hello, welcome back to my channel. I hope you're all ready for another Euphoria makeup look. Today I'm going to be recreating Cassie's look from the iconic scene where Maddie goes and knocks on the door and Cassie and Nate are in the bathroom. And that is all I'm going to say. So now we've got to the point in the series where Maddie has found out that Cassie and Nate are you know so by the time you see this video another episode will be out and there'll be so much more drama there but i've already recreated maddie's look so i'll leave the link somewhere so you can go and watch that and now i'm gonna recreate cassie's look because i want to have the like iconic duo looks and they're just like a good couple i think they're such a good duo so we're gonna get straight into it and let's start the makeup first i'm gonna moisturize Cassie's makeup look is really glowy. It also doesn't look like she's got much foundation on, so I'm just gonna do a really natural concealer. But first, I'm gonna start with brows. So I'm using the Soft Brown Revolution Pro Eyebrow Pomade and just a normal brush. I do my eyebrows in like every single video the exact same way, so I'm not gonna go into too much detail. I'm so excited to do this makeup look because Cassie is like my female celebrity crush. Like, I won't even lie about it. She is absolutely gorgeous, and uh, I generally don't think that we can disagree. And I saw those two. TikToks about her being like ugly oh my god she started the night really pretty and then she ended up looking like this and i was thinking you honestly haven't had a good party if you don't know that by the end of the night you are meant to look like crap i just don't know where these little trolls are coming from but please just go back into your hole because sydney sweeney is bloody gorgeous and i'm just gonna make the ends a little bit darker there we go this top is giving me such summer vibes i just miss summer so hard i like i'm an aries i'm a fire sign i need to be in the sun hopefully we're gonna go somewhere sunny this year probably not because i've got no money because i'm a broke uni student now i'm coming out of brows but i am actually going out i'm going out i am actually going somewhere this year for a little trip i am going to see sam fender I'm so, 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 so excited. I'm absolutely in love with Sam Fender. My boyfriend's taking me to see him. I shouldn't really be saying this, but I do. I do. I can't deny. I adore Sam Fender. He's from Newcastle and, you know, I'm a big Newcastle fan. But I'm just so excited. I know all of the songs and I'm going to blend out the concealer. I'm not going to use foundation today. I'm just going to use concealer. So I'm going to do that on the rest of my face, under my eyes, because I have dark circles on the top of my head and then down my nose and then again i'm gonna blend that out and now i'm gonna do a little bit of contour with the chill cheek contour kit and now i'm gonna put this on my cheeks and on the top of my head make me look a little bit more tan and then a little bit under my nose and a little bit under my lip and now i'm gonna take my blush it's just a revolution palette and i'm gonna mix those together and pop this on my cheeks if you have the charlotte tilbury blush i am so jealous I can't get my hands on it. I really wish I had that because it would make it a lot more glowy and dewy. So if you do have that, use that instead. What I wanted, what I got. And I'm gonna take this purple highlighter and put it on the high point of my face. Again, if you've got a liquid highlighter, use that instead. It'll give it so much more of a glowy finish. Now it's time for eyes, the main part of the look. So I'm taking my identity palette from Beauty Bear and I'm going to take one of the base colours, this one at the top, and just put that all over my eyelid. What does everyone want the ending to be for Euphoria? I don't want to ruin it. I feel like I need to talk about it. The Rouge Mom and Sister have found out that she started using drugs again. So everyone's having like an intervention to make sure that she's like okay and she goes back to rehab. But to take the attention away from herself, Rue tells everyone about Cassie and Nate and what they've been getting up to. Obviously, Maddie flips as she should and then Rue kind of like kicks off and her mom tries to take her a rehab and that's when the episode finishes so I wonder what's gonna happen now I'm literally so excited I love Euphoria I really want to see in three now I'm gonna hop over to my revolution palette and I'm gonna take this pink up here use that very very lightly again all across my eyes this is just to brighten it up a bit in the photos it does look a lot more like orangey but i just wanted to bright it up and now i'm gonna go in with this brown color in my beauty bear palette again and put that on the outer side of my eye now i'm gonna go and take this shade to try and blend the colors together a little bit more now i'm gonna take that pink again and put it in the inner corner of my eye and blend it over i'm gonna go in with the brown that we used earlier and put that underneath my eye just to give it that like smudged effect and now i'm just gonna make sure that everything's nicely blended and now we're gonna add mascara First, I'm gonna curl my eyelashes with my Skinny Dip eyelash curler. This is such a nice eyeshadow look for like warm colored hair, so like blonde and ginger. I always find it really hard to find like nice colors for my hair. This is actually really cute. Now I'm gonna put mascara on. I'm gonna do like a decent amount just because she isn't wearing lashes in the photo. Can we also talk about how good of an actress Zendaya is? She's so amazing. Like her spectrum of acting is 
astounded. She plays so many good characters, like obviously Rue from Euphoria. I've got no idea what her name was in the Dune film, but she was really good in that too. The Showman, Marie and Malcolm, or Malcolm and Marie, I can't remember which around it is. I think that movie and Euphoria show how good of an actor she is. In the trailer, if you haven't seen Marie and Malcolm before, go and watch it, it's amazing. In the trailer, she's like showing how a breakdown, and then you find out in the movie, she's literally just acting for her boyfriend who didn't like cast her in his film. But obviously, if you watch it, you'll find that out. Okay, now for the exciting part, we're gonna put the gems on. So I have a lot of these, so if you want any more Euphoria makeup looks, let me know. I am planning to do one. Hopefully, there'll be a really good makeup look in the last episode, and then I can do that as like the final season two send off, because I'm really enjoying doing these Euphoria looks. The way I'm gonna add the rhinestones is I'm gonna get my eyelash glue, and I'm just gonna pop on where I want the rhinestones to go. So Cassie has three going up and then four along. I'm gonna get up close and personal with you so you can see. And I'm just gonna mark out where I want them to go. I'm gonna take my tweezers. I'm just gonna pick it up off of the sheet. I won't lie. It works so much better when you try and do it with your fingers. It might not for other people, but I found that that worked. <laughs> There we go. Oh my God, we're glowing. <laughs> so that's the first row done. Now we're gonna do the top row, which has four. So again, I'm gonna mark out where I want them to be. Last one on this side. Okay, so the eyes are done. That was easier than I thought it would be. So I'm really happy with that. They look so nice and pretty and just, I just wanna be in Euphoria. Actually, no, that would mean that my life would be full of drama. No, never mind. But that is the face makeup done. So I'm gonna put my setting spray on. I'm using the NYX Radiant Finish setting spray. And because it's radiant finish, I'm hoping it'll give me like that nice glowy sparkly look. Now that the makeup is all done, I'm gonna curl my hair. I feel like everyone knows how to curl the hair, but I'm just gonna section it up, start with the bottom layer and then work up. Look at the little kinks that that's left in my hair. Oh no. Hair is curled, now I'm gonna put my sparkly clips in. How cute does that look? Oh my god, I feel so much like Cassie from before. I feel like she's more of my character than Maddie is. This is so much more me. Oh my god, I love it. So yeah, this is a finished makeup look. Hey Carmen, it's me. I've been thinking about you lately. I miss you. Call me back. So that is the end of the video. Thank you so much for watching. Please let me know if you want any more Euphoria makeup looks down below and tell me what to do, which ones do you want. Please like and subscribe and follow my Instagram, which is Emma underscore Kirsten underscore. And you'll see all the behind the scenes and all these makeup looks on there too. So I'll leave that on the screen or in the description. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you in my next video. Bye.